Hey everyone, this is Tim from Your Six Studios. Today in this video, I'm going to go ahead and show you where to plug in your SSD on your computer's motherboard. So let's go ahead and jump into the video right now. So I've just picked up a new SSD. This is the Samsung 980, and it kind of looks like a stick of gum. It's very thin, and this goes directly in your motherboard. Now, where would you actually plug this in? Now, I have a very cramped PC set up right here for my motherboard. Here's my GPU, my CPU, my RAM. Now, right in between everything is where I actually plug in my SSD. Now, you may see some numbers on your motherboard and a screw, and it says 110, 80, 60, and 42. Well, those screw holes are where you're going to be plugging in your SSD. So go ahead and take off that screw and then plug in your SSD right there. Now for me, this is really cramped. I may have to take out my GPU if I want to go ahead and put this in, but I think I should be able to do this without removing anything. All right, and it really helps if you have a magnetic screwdriver. So when you take out that screw, it just lifts up with your screwdriver. Now you can kind of measure this out and see where you want to place the small like uh, I would say maybe it's like a spacer that comes with it and you want to place this just in the appropriate screw hole so it looks like I'm going to be right where it is at 80 so I'm not going to have to move that at all so you're going to want to place that screw where it says 60 42 80 or 110 so your SSD actually sits on top of it and it actually doesn't touch the motherboard with the back end and you can see there is a small like half circle right here where it's going to get screwed into your motherboard and it's going to rest on that spacer so there's a small gap between your motherboard and the SSD. Now I'm going to go ahead and slot it in and then push it into the little slot right here. Boom and you'll kind of hear a snap when it's actually slot in correctly and you may have to push this down so it rests against that spacer. Then take your screw and screw it on down to the motherboard. Now, if you are going to be installing Windows on this new SSD, I'd suggest unplugging any other drive that you have plugged in. So like this other SSD I have right here, I would go ahead and unplug that. And then if I have any other hard drives, I would unplug those. So only my SSD I just installed is displaying and I don't actually install Windows on a different drive. And I'm going to be installing primarily just video games on this. And maybe some applications as well, like my video editor. So hopefully this video did indeed help you out. If it did, go ahead and leave it a big thumbs up. And subscribe to my channel down below for more tech help videos coming up next on Your Six Studios.